Some residents out of a developing West Lubbock neighborhood are upset after they say has been quite a spike in attempted break-ins near and around their homes. However, some of these residents are doing what they can to not become a victim by increasing neighborhood security on their own. Our Leslie Adamy got to meet with some of those residents in the neighborhood. She joins us now from the HD News Center with more. Leslie. Hey there, Terry. Well, according to a recent study, Lubbock actually ranks number three in property crime rates among mid sized cities in the West. Now, some of that may have to do with the fact that we are a growing city and some of those newer developments are certainly feeling those growing pains. But some residents are taking matters into their own hands by creating a new neighborhood watch program. It's been a frustrating past couple of weeks for Lynn Hicks. This was off, it was just dangling. These, they were trying, they tried to splice. She and her husband bought this new West Lubbock home with hopes of actually renting it out. But as of late, she says she and neighbors feel as though there has been a spike in attempted home and auto break-ins in this new developing neighborhood. And we thought Lubbock, that would be, you know, that would be nice, but I still think Lubbock is great. I just think houses are being built like crazy and the police can't keep up with it. A resident who requested they stayed anonymous shared with us this footage of what appears to be two men attempting to break into their car. The resident told us that while they weren't able to strike luck at their property, the robbers did get into one a few houses down. Then I found out how often that's happening in the area. Residents in this neighborhood, however, say they're taking a stand against the recent break-ins, many of them installing security cameras, and now creating a neighborhood patrol group that will make rounds as early as 2 a.m. Believable. I've never seen anything like this. They're helping each other. They're all just great people. I mean, they're getting up from 2 a.m. to 5 a.m. or whatever. They switch different times to, you know, watch stuff for everyone else. The new Neighborhood Watch program is working with PD to keep crimes like this as low as possible. Higgs says she hopes to see an end to the troubling trend soon. In a perfect world, you wish that wasn't the case. And actually, just before we arrived to Hicks's home earlier this evening, it appeared that someone happened to break into the home today as the back door was left open. Now, fortunately, nothing was taken or seemed to be broken.